Pooja, you worked with a lot of young girls in India, many of whom were your age. What sort of cultural differences did you see between them and um, you and your friends here in the U.S.? So predominantly it was the language barrier I have with the girls, but I felt this deep sort of connection with them that was very unique, um, considering that they lived in completely different lifestyles than what I do here. And um, as much as they learned from me, I actually learned a lot more from them. They got happy out of like such small things. They were so inspiring. And um, we actually had women empowerment discussions together. And I learned so much more from them than I think they learned from me. It was amazing. Um, they had a huge perspective and reference frame of the world. And many of us here in Los Angeles and America are you know, caught up in these small little details of our lives and get upset and depressed about these small little things. But despite them living in such poor circumstances, they were so happy about everything. And um, it's definitely something we can all learn from them. Sure. And personally, is there anything uh, in particular that you took away from this experience in India? Um, just the need for this type of thing. Um, just, I learned that there's so much power in activism rather than advocating for something or raising money for something. There's so much power in going to a different country and actually you know, socially empowering them or politically or economically empowering women. And um, there's a huge, huge change of lifestyle there um, in terms of gender inequality. Mm -hmm. uh, there were a few girls in my class actually who were in eighth, ninth grade who were actually married. And you know, that's something that's completely unfathomable to many of us mm -hmm. here. And it's important for us to not just be caught up in our lifestyle, but actually want to or feel the need to do something there. What was the response like to this training program? I'm sure this was the first time they were exposed to something like this. Tell me about that. Yeah, it was completely new. Like they had, they were, they were actually really, really grateful that um, someone was doing this. Mm -hmm. And there was a huge need, um, especially in Delhi, where it's considered to be the rape capital of the world. And a lot of people were actually very supportive of it. I thought um, maybe when going to the rural segment of the population, a lot of people would be, um, be like, who's this American trying to infringe on mm -hmm. our, you know, rights or trying to change the culture? But um, a lot of people were really, really supportive. Sure. And what about the response um, in LA? In LA, the support was phenomenal, mm -hmm. um, especially from Girl Scouts and a lot of other organizations like Sir Optimist. Um, I had, you know, my mayor asked me to speak at the councils. I had, I had a bunch of speaking opportunities. I um, worked in domestic violence shelters and homeless women shelters before, so they were all um, extremely supportive. Sure. So, how long have you been a Girl Scout for, Pooja? Um, I've been a Girl Scout for about seven, eight years since I was like third, fourth grade. And how has that shaped you, um, you know, to the young woman that you are today? Yeah, Girl Scouts teaches the ideals of leadership and responsibility, but most importantly, um, how to be passionate for something and not just advocating for something that you're passionate about, but actually actively doing something about it. And um, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of campaigns to end world hunger or gender equality, but there's very few people who actually do something about it. So I Watch the remaining show on ITV Gold. Subscribe to ITV Gold on Time Warner Cable Channel 1539. ITV Gold is America's first full-time television channel that caters to the South Asian community. Your favorite dramas with English subtitles. Watch movies, back-to-back -back songs, award-winning local news coverage, and much, much more. Subscribe to ITV Gold on Time Warner Cable Channel 1539. Part of the 8-channel combo pack for $39.95. And our East Coast viewers can also subscribe to ITV on RCN Channel 476 and Cablevision on Channel 1168.